Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David and this is a deck review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here. Thanks for showing up. It's Monday. Yep, it's Monday. And on every Monday, what's going on over here? And on every Monday, I do a deck review, or at least I try to, because that's how this channel started. This channel didn't start off as um, a magic review show. This channel didn't start off uh, being sponsored. This channel started off as me only opening up all my decks of cards, showing you my deck collection, and just telling you how excited I was about playing cards, playing card designers, different types of decks that came out. Uh, sure, there were some magic decks thrown in there as well, but I mean, I've been, I've been a big fan of playing cards since forever. So if you like that kind of thing, uh, please hit me up with a like, subscribe to this channel, support channels that tell you about new playing cards, the latest and the greatest. Today, we're gonna look at the runes playing cards from Bicycle and PlayingCardDecks.com. All right, the Bicycle runes playing cards. This was an April 2021 pip box club selection at PlayingCardDecks.com. This is a completely custom deck of playing cards based on the Elder Futhark, the oldest runic alphabet from Germanic and Nordic tribes. It says bicycle up at the top, and you have this gold foil rune all the way around, and what looks like a Germanic ace of spades there in the center. It says runes, playing cards underneath that. One side says air cushion finish made in the USA. The other side says the United States Playing Card Company. The bottom has some ad copy. About PlayingCardDecks.com, the back, of course, is the back design of the cards. You have a standard United States Playing Card Company tuck seal, and it says limited edition poker size up at the top. That's everything I can say about the tuck case. Let's look at the cards. Of course, that means these cards are printed from the United States Playing Card Company on classic stock. They are traditionally cut, which means they have a tapered cut, and that'll make table pharaohs a little easier. They're a standard poker size, they have air cushion embossed finish, and there are metallic inks used on the cards and on the box. The back design is a mixture of gold metallics and a burnt umber, almost tobacco brown color. The back design is based on the famous rune circles, and it is a two-way image. With this deck, you'll get a double backer, which is great for magic tricks, and you'll get an informational card that'll be a legend, or it'll be a key, for that runic alphabet. You're gonna find a total of 24 runic letters used on the number and court cards. With this deck, you'll have two original jokers. The rune that's featured here is a decorative octogram, and the runes on the four aces each spell out their corresponding suit. On your face cards, you'll see that the setup and the layout is the same for your pips and indices cards as well as your court cards. Blacks are still black, reds are still red, but you also have this rune circle and then you have one of those uh, Germanic Nordic symbols there in the center. Uh, but besides being a very fun and unique deck that you could use for card games, it's also perfect for performing mysterious themed magic tricks and used for cardomancy. But that's just everything I can say about what the cards look like. You also want to know how they feel and how they handle. Well, of course, they're made by Bicycle, right? United States Playing Card Company pretty much make the best cards on the planet. Uh, but you can take 10 cards, put them in a caliper, measure them and compare them against other decks in my collection. 10 cards in the caliper come to 2.87. 2.87 is a thicker stock, which means they're a B stock. They're a casino grade stock, which means they're going to be thick, crisp, crunchy. They're going to hold their shape for a good long time. All right, that's everything I can say about the runes playing cards from PlayingCardDecks.com. I want to thank Will Roya and everyone down at PlayingCardDecks.com for allowing me to have this deck so that I could do the review for you. And if you'd like to purchase it for yourself, you can find it right now at PlayingCardDecks.com or wherever quality playing cards are sold. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye. But wait, are you not getting enough magic orthodoxy in your life? Not getting enough of your very favorite magic reviews? Good news, you can join this channel. That's right, you can join Magic Orthodoxy for only $1.99 a month. $1.99 gives you access to eight brand new videos every single month. Eight, eight new videos that are unseen 
by the rest of the world. You will have exclusive access to them. Plus, if you join right now for a buck 99, you'll get access to over a hundred videos that are already in the membership section. That's right, a hundred videos. What kind of content? Even more magic videos, top 10 lists, best of the year, head to head magic tricks, and my exclusive thoughts on performance and theory. Two extra videos every single week, $1.99. Just scroll down to where it says Magic Orthodoxy. There's a button next to it that says Join. Click the Join button and it'll walk you through a series of menus that'll hook you up and get you access today.